Hey guys, Jim from Measure Square here. In this video, we're going to go over how we can leverage the tile and tile patterns in order to get our quantities for raised access flooring. To start off, we need to create three products, two tile products and one linear product. So we'll create a tile for the panel and a tile for the pedestal, so I have an 18 by 18 and a four by four, and then just a basic linear foot product for the stringer. Now we'll head over to the panel and we're going to right click on it, go to design tile pattern width. And from here, we need to add in the pedestal tile from the top panel. We're gonna grab it by the red handle, bring it towards the top right corner, make sure it snaps on the line. And then we're going to move back to our top tools and make this an insert. Now we'll see the pattern pop up on the right side. We're going to choose the correct pattern. Now we're going to save it to our pattern so we'll be able to use this in the future. So just name it whatever you would like so it's easy to find. So in this case, I'll name it raised access flooring. Hit OK. Now this will be saved to our tile patterns towards the bottom left. It's in alphabetical order. So we can go ahead and grab that one. Once I drag it over, I'll be able to select the panel and also the pedestal. And then we're gonna add the linear foot stringer to our grout to get that linear foot calc. Click in the room, and now we'll see our pattern be added with our panel, pedestal, and stringer. We'll see our quantities popping up on the left side. And we'll also see those pop up on the right side for those tile counts. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned.